Well. Now, you know, I never really did show you a good rope trick. I, I've got one here. It's the famous rope trick. Actually, one of, the, uh, one of the crew mentioned that they'd seen a magician do this, and so I thought I'd try it. Now, I haven't really practiced it much, but it's the famous cut and restored rope trick. And uh, usually what a magician does is he gets a rope and he gets a pair of scissors. And then what he does is he cuts the rope, all right? So why don't we do that? We cut the rope. Now, if I was a really good magician, I'd be able to make the two ropes become one. Do you want to see that happen? Yeah! Now, I, I haven't really practiced it, so I, I have to do my magic turn, okay? Magic turn about. And uh, when I turn around and face you again, the rope will be in one whole piece. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> oh, you're not... All right, all right. Some of you think that there's a rope that I, that I tied a knot and the knot's in my hand, right? If I were to show you there's no knot in my hand, would you be happy with that? Yeah. Listen, here we are. Look at that. There's no knot in my hand, you see? Isn't that amazing? Oh, oh there's no knot there. Can yeah, anybody see a knot there? Come on, there's no knot there. There was a knot there. It's not a knot there. Oh. Oh, I, I, I knew I should have practiced that. So, so you don't like that knot there? All right, how about there? Do you like it there? No, you don't like it there. Maybe we can move the knot down there. Maybe you like it there. Get that there. No, you don't like it there either. Well, why don't we just take it right off and say, Merry Christmas! And so I've finally done it, the famous cut and restored rope trick. But the kind of magic, boys and girls, that is my favorite is the kind of magic that you make happen. And you're going to all make this next trick happen. Uh, here I've got three handkerchiefs and they're tied on a ribbon. And uh, we could give them names. We could call one Mr. Greeny, Mr. Orangey, and Mr. Inbetweeny. Now I'm going to ask somebody up close here to pick one just right from where you are. Would you like Mr. Greeny, Mr. Orangey, or Mr. Inbetweeny? Yeah. Mr. Inbetweeny. Now, you know what you're going to do? You're going to make this happen. What I want you to do is stretch out your arms as far as they'll go. I want you to look at Mr. Inbetweeny and imagine that your hands are becoming invisible. They're stretching all the way up here to Mr. Inbetweeny, and you're going to untie him. Are you ready? No, not you. You didn't want you untied. Somebody was thinking of that, of that one. All right, Mr. Inbetweeny, let's untie Mr. Inbetweeny. That's it, you did it! Wonderful. Give yourselves a big hand. And now I need someone else to pick another one. Yes, you. Mr. Greeny, that's a good choice. All right, then you all know what to do. Everyone, stretch your arms out as far as they'll go. Your hands are becoming invisible. You're going to invisibly untie Mr. Greeny. Are you ready? Yeah, you did it! Give yourselves a big hand. Wow, you're wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful group. And now, and now I have another volunteer that's going to help me do my next trick. And that is Jordan. Come on up here, Jordan. Give Jordan a big hand as he comes up here. Okay, Jordan. Oh, Jordan, you're going to help me do a magic trick here. And uh, I've got a magic wand. Do you feel magical at all? No, you don't. Well, I'm going to give you my magic wand, and I want you to hold it high in the air, and when you do, the magic will drip down and into the arms and all that, and you'll become very magical, okay? So Jordan's holding the magic wand high in the air. As he holds it high in the air, what's going to happen is the magic will drip down, and it'll be cause... No, 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 no. Hold on, Jordan. Maybe I gave you the wrong end. Maybe if you took it by that end, that's it. Jordan's got the magic wand by that end. If you thought it by that end, we can make the magic wand. <laughs> Hold it, maybe, Jordan, if we give it to you by the middle, all right? Jordan's got it by the middle. Okay, he's got the magic wand by the middle. And because he's got it by the middle, we can make it. <laughs> oh, my goodness, that's not so good. Well, you know what, Jordan? I'm going to have to give you my super-duper magic hat, okay? And I've got it in here somewhere. Ah, here we are, Jordan. Aha! Uh -huh. Now, the way this magic hat works, Jordan. There we are. Now, 
Let me explain how this magic hat works. The way it works is the magic drips from the magic wand down into the brain cells, making Jordan a very magical person, almost as magical as me, okay? So tell me, Jordan, do you feel magical? Yeah. You do? You don't look any more magical than you did before. You sure you're feeling magical, Jordan? I don't know. You don't know, no, you know, maybe it's not working. Maybe it's not working. Uh, let, let, let me just check the magic wand here, make sure it is working, because sometimes things don't work quite well. Yeah, I don't know, it should work, Jordan. The magic wand should work because it's, you know, and then, ah, oh, my God, oh my goodness, oh, I forgot, uh, I forgot about that. I, 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 need, I needed some way for the magic wand to, to sit on there, and it, it seemed like a good idea at the time. No, that's not fair. Jordan, you're awesome! Wonderful. Well, now, how would you like to help me create some magic presents for everyone? All right. Well, first of all, let's show everyone we've, what we've got here is we've got, a, we've got a box there. There's nothing in that one. See that, Jordan? And we've got a, a box here, and there's nothing in that one. So there's nothing there, and nothing there. No, 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 there's nothing there. And uh, so, Jordan, what you're going to do is you're going to say the magic phrase, Abracadabra, cadabra, cadu. Make a whole bunch of Christmas presents for you and me. <laughs> It'll be nice. Let's just see. Oh, look at that, Jordan. We've got some some neat things in here. Now. Wow, where did they come from? Some neat things in there. Wow, look at that, Jordan. Give me back that magic wand, Jordan. Let's just see what have we got here. Christmas presents. Jordan, why don't you take that Christmas present and walk down those stairs very carefully now. We'll just see how many Christmas presents there are here. Oh my goodness, oh, look at that, Christmas presents. Well, of course, Christmas is a wonderful time, isn't it? A time when Christmas presents magically seem to appear under the tree. A time to wish Merry Christmas to all the folks all over. Jordan, maybe you better walk down the aisle there. I don't know, there seems to be a lot of stuff in here. And uh, wow, what a wonderful time. Christmas is. <laughs> and uh, wow, wonderful. Is there never an end to this? My goodness gracious, this is unreal. Okay. Now, can you bring it all back here, Jordan? And let's give Jordan a big hand for helping us. Thank you, Jordan, for helping us. Okay. Eric Johnson here and all the boys and girls at Bayview Public School in Owen Sound wishing you all a very, very Christmas. Merry Christmas, everyone.